Attention all boys, it is No Nut November, the most difficult month of the year. This is how to go the whole month without nutting. Uh, before we begin, a moment of silence for all those soldiers who have fallen this month already. Alright, let's get right into it. Step one, take yourself to a secluded location where no women can be found. I chose this farm because I'm yet to convince a woman to come this far from the city and see me, let alone see me at all when I'm in the city. I don't actually ever see any women. Step two, you're gonna need to disconnect yourself from all forms of media. This means television, the internet, pornographic magazines. This removes anything that will tempt your brain or your pain. Step three, every day when you wake up, splash your face with cold water and say your daily mantra. This will be a lordly day. Step four, remove all objects from your house that remind you of ungodly acts. This banana reminds me of a dick, which makes me think of the nut. This nut bar, these are gonna have to go. Gonna have to all go in the bin. Peanut butter, nut Nutella. We don't even have Nutella. What sort of family are we? What the fuck is going on? Step five, uh, I was caught, I slipped. And um, now Jackson's Ooh. administered the shackles. So um, if all else fails, got some shackles so he can't use his hands. And I can't see. There is no can't way. There is no way I am failing No Nut November because the boys have got my back. Right, that's just about enough out of us. Now we've got some opinions on how to survive No Nut November from some of our friends on the internet. Some of our friends. Word of the street is you're trying to do the No Nut November challenge, and a way to do this is you have to stop the sexual urges, and a way to do that is castration. What you do is you take your little cock out, put it on the counter, and then you stab it! To be brutally honest, the best way to survive is to have a photo of your grandma close by, or your mum, or your sister. That works only if you're not from Tasmania. How do I survive No Nut November? Well, it's pretty easy actually, because I have a severe peanut allergy. Everyone brings a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I don't know why. They're gross. Maybe it's because their parents didn't care enough to make them a real sandwich. So yeah, it's pretty easy for me to survive No Nut November <laughs> because I don't really have much of a choice. I will die. Well, if you're looking for some advice from me about not nutting, I can't really help you out as I am a virgin. Well, I've used my hand many occasions over the thought of my grandmother. I can't really help you guys out. Don't have any tips for not nutting, but best of luck for No Nut November and I love you all. And that's, um, I'm really lonely. <laughs> wow, thanks for that, good friends. Uh, <laughs> that's all we've got for you today. So make sure you smash like and you smash subscribe. But remember, don't smash your meat staff this month. And if you want to be a soldier, you cannot touch your rod today. <laughs> Bye.